Welcome back. Now news from sports. The Tata T Jagore Soccer Stars 2010 kicked off at the Don Bosco High School ground in Panji on Friday. The inter-school tournament is coordinated by High Life Management from Calcutta in association with the Don Bosco College of Physical Education. 32 schools from all over Goa are battling out to qualify for the All India Tournament. The under-15 football contest saw many young talents compete for top honours. More importantly, to finish among the final 16 players who will represent India at the International Soccer Festival at the Emirates Stadium, home of Arsenal Football Club. Manager of High Life Management, Bradley Williams, explained the format of this tournament. With me, I have Bradley Williams. He's the manager for High Life uh, and, uh, Management. They are coordinating this uh, event, this football contest of Tata T Jagore. So can you tell us the format of this whole tournament? It's a tournament we are doing in 10 cities. Where in Goa we have 32 teams that are taking part. It's uh, three in each group. And we have one team from each group qualify. It's a 7 aside format. Reason being 7 aside, it's easier to uh, spot talent. We play 7 aside. The closer, it's easier to spot talent. We play 11 aside, it's too spread out. So ta spotting talent there, it's a little difficult. So when you play a 7 aside, the closer, so you see there's more talent, it's easier to spot talent out there. Uh, the format of this tournament, we have uh, the first day where we do league come on the league matches. Where from each group we have one team qualified. Where the next day we do all the knockouts, starting with your pre quarter finals, then your quarter finals, semis, and finals. That's the format of this tournament. Uh, it's a seven aside, seven minutes a half, and all normal football rules we have in this. How these players get started to go to Arsenal? We have a scout, Jamshed Nasiri, uh, who selects, he watches in two days in that, two days matches, and he selects. Three, the top, three top players that he feels that are talented and those three players are selected to take part in the Arsenal camp which is in the month of June where we have two coaches coming from London from the Arsenal School of Soccer. They train these 30 boys for two weeks and from that they select the best 16 come to London to take part in an Arsenal International Soccer Festival. So uh, can you tell us the other programs Tata T is organizing? Uh, Tata has started with uh, football uh, at the school. Uh, now they are trying to get into a college program uh, and the next step is getting into a national sport hockey which is a little uh, down at the moment but I guess with the World Cup happening I'm sure we'll get some response once we, we get into it. So presently you are concentrating only on football? Oh, no, in Grasso. A sports reporter from Panji, Noel D'Souza with video journalist Omkar Falari. Mother of Mercy High School from Vasco won the first DG Narvikar Inter-School Girls Cricket Tournament on Friday. Mother of Mercy beat Progress High School from Sankili by 72 runs in the final. The Under-17 tournament was organised by the Goa Cricket Association and played at their academy ground in Porvore. 31 schools from the state participated in the tournament. In the final match, Mother of Mercy won the toss and elected to bat. The Vasco school set up a total of 118 runs for the loss of 7 wickets in the allotted 20 overs. Ravina Korgaonkar top scored with 34 runs. Mother of Mercy put up a fine bowling performance as well, bundling out Progress High School for 46 runs in just 9.3 overs. None of the Progress Bats women could reach double figures. Pooja Halankar picked up 5 wickets for Mother of Mercy. GCA President Advocate Dayanand Narvekar, Secretary Prasad Fatherbekar, Treasurer Vinod Fadke, GCA's Women's Wing Convener Sushma Narvekar and other GCA members were present for the prize distribution. Bhakti Naik of Mother of Mercy won the Best Bowler Award while Rupali Parab of Progress High School was named Best Batswoman. Ravina Kurgaonkar of Mother of Mercy was adjudged as the Player of the Tournament and Player of the Final. Our sports reporter from Purvuri, Patterson Fernandez with video journalist Omkar Falari. We can express ourselves in so many ways, like from face expressions and through eyes. Today in our video of the day, we have some fabulous actions shown by hands. Watch these hand movements and enjoy the video. Stay tuned to Prudent for more news. Take care and goodbye.
Then on the night time 